Hey, I'm Ross and welcome back to Roscoe Reviews. On today's, not really a review, I'm going to show you how to hook up your Starlink modem to any other ethernet device. So if you want to plug a computer into it or if you want to plug uh, another router into this, so that if you've already got your house set up uh, how you want it with your own router, then you can use your own router instead of the one that Starlink provides. Uh, I've recently changed over my internet in my house to Starlink and when the router came, it doesn't have an ethernet port on it anywhere. I've never actually seen a router that didn't have an ethernet port, but apparently Starlink did that. So uh, you can change this to add an ethernet port, but you have to go to Starlink's website and order the ethernet port adapter. So I will include a link down below where you can find this. It's in the Starlink store and that's the only place where you can get it. They don't sell them on Amazon or anything. It's really easy to set up, so I'll show you how. I have my Starlink dish outside and the cord run inside to my Starlink router, but I already have all my house set up on another system. Like my house is really spread out and I have nodes on, on both ends of the house so that I can connect my, to my shop and everything. And that, all that's already set up with this router. So to make things simpler, Starlink does sell the nodes so you can purchase them and put them throughout your house. Uh, I've decided to try to just plug into my old router and see how that works. So I've unplugged my Starlink system and I've unplugged this other router. And now we're going to add the adapter to the Starlink modem. It's easy to do. You just need to unplug the dish side, which is this one. So you're gonna unplug the dish side, which is this one right here. Looks like this. You're gonna unplug the dish from your router. Then you will instead plug in the adapter it looks like this. You're going to plug the adapter in. To the router. And then you'll plug your dish. Into the same hole on. The ethernet adapter. And then you will have uh, an ethernet port on here. So then you plug the dish into the ethernet adapter. Starlink makes everything easy because it always just goes one way, which is great. And now you have an Ethernet port that you can plug your computer into, or you can plug your other router into, anything that you're wanting to connect via Ethernet. Uh, some people like to plug their TVs in directly, so uh, this would be good for that as well. Now that the Ethernet adapter is plugged in to the Starlink router, I just need to plug my old router directly into that Ethernet port. Same as I would uh, if I was getting internet some other way. I'm gonna have to play hide the wires later. Now we're gonna plug in both the Starlink and I'm gonna wanna plug that in first and then I will plug in my other router and I should have internet the same as I had before uh, when I was ordering internet through a different company and it should go through all the nodes and all my devices will be connected as they always were. This is how you install a, an ethernet port on your Starlink router. I hope you found this helpful. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you back here next time.